Hello and welcome back to the colony with Man and the Ants. We are back in Battle Group VR. So last time we ran through the first couple of missions, got ourselves a little bit of money, a few of these upgrade points. We came back to our hub, because you don't have to come back to the hub after missions if you recall. You can choose to stay out there to continue a bonus rolling over, but thought we'd come back. We got enough points to unlock this slot here for three, three SIM cards is what it looks like, isn't it? And we also have a good chunk of money as well. So I've been looking through these and I think we're going to go for the Assault Frigate, because that is the, a general sort of workhorse looks like it's a little bit of everything medium to close range combat i think that sounds pretty good so we're going to unlock this slot my that is a loud sound effect thank you game we are going to purchase this wonderful we have a ship we need a captain for it so we will go for i mean what is going on with you let's have a little look at you uh, i mean how can i how can I say no to those beautiful blue eyes? It doesn't matter what it says. It doesn't matter what it says. I'm having him. That's what... <laughs> That's insane. <laughs> Look at that guy. I'm assuming they're like... They're, they're like, um, artificial eyes. But it does just look like someone's put, like, the little sticky wobbly eyes on his face, doesn't it? That is fantastic. Thank you, Lex. That is... I couldn't ask for better. He's more skilled than our current pilot as well. Our current, um, admiral, I suppose she would be. She's admiral of the fleet. So... He had some... <laughs> can't get over it. I can't. Do I... Because he had some points, didn't he? Yeah, so let's get some points on him. Um, we have four points. And I assume it's one for each one. So let's just go one on each. And then we'll go... We'll go increase firepower. I always like a little bit of damage. Does she have any points? She does not have any points available. So they're all fine. Let's look at the... Well, let's look at our specific, because we're happy with this one. I don't know if this comes with comes with things. I'm assuming so. It does, yes. So we have a few things. We have two light cannon turrets available. What is it we've got in here? We have a light cannon turret. Okay. And a light cannon turret. And that's going to be a light cannon turret. Yep. And we don't have anything we can go in. Oh, we have, have to, well, we haven't got them yet. How much money do we have? We have a little bit of money, actually. A shield injector we'd need to unlock. Maybe we'd want to focus that on our... Um... We can upgrade the guns as well. That's interesting. Oh, that's what the little three three pips are for. I see. I see. I like it shows you the arc of its, uh, arc of its attack as well. Um, we do have a light missile turret. I think I'll probably put a light missile turret on that one. Because that's what we did on our main ship as well. I like the idea of that. I like the idea of that. Um, we'll probably leave that at that. Let's just go back to the shipyard, go back to our ship. We do have a... Oh, we put a laser on So we've got a laser and a missile. Okay, that works out okay then. And we upgraded our lancer beam as well. I might... How much does it cost to upgrade these? I might upgrade both of those. And the same on him. I might upgrade both of those. And how much is it to upgrade that? Yeah, I'm going to upgrade that as well then. So they're both kind of equally matched in terms of their upgrades and everything. I'm happy with that. We don't want to set it as the flagship. Our other one is the flagship. What's this one called? Uh, the Thebes. Okay, that's quite nice. I like that. What's our other one called? Leo. That's also fine. I'm happy with that. Is there anything else we want to think about? I don't think so. We don't have much money to unlock anything else. I don't want to spend all my money, I don't think. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. So we're going to go into... How do we get out of this? Oh, launch, I suppose. Fleet has at least one ship. All ships are assigned captains, and the flagship has been set. Excellent. That's going to bring this a little bit closer towards me. So we have... Oh, we have two missions available, actually. Three missions available. Are these... Are these ones we've done before, or...? Defend the Judicator and Scorch transport to the warp point. Destroy the convoy before they escape to the warp point. I'm a little... A little unsure if those are ones we've done before. Why are they different colours? Defend the station and drive back the enemy. Uh, yeah, see that one? That one sounds familiar and that one sounds familiar. But that one's green and that one's not. So... I'm assuming the one is like a difficulty level? Or is that because it's different mission types? Because that's a defense. Is that why it's green? I don't know. You get you get the escort carrier. You, you get you get an escort carrier for that. 
Or is green like, <clears throat> excuse me. It's green like you, you can do this one. These ones are a bit out of your range. No, that's two, that's one. Well, that says escort frigate as well. And a science vessel. Oh. 15,000, 10,000. 12,000. Well, I, I guess we'll go... Is green maybe the one that they suggest you do? Escort. Raid. Yeah, they got different. I don't know. We'll do this one. We're going to do this one. And then I'm going to valiantly try to remember the controls as we go. Because it has been a little while since I played. <laughs> it's been, I think it's been like a couple of weeks since I recorded the first video. So... My memories are a little hazy. Do we get like a launch sequence? <gasps> is it because I'm on a different ship or is that always there? I'm confused. Greetings. Oh, it's Idris Elba. Forgot. <laughs> Is me? No. That's why I'm here. Am I on the other ship? I'm confused as to what... Uh... Yeah, I should turn that off really because I, really, I haven't had a chance to look into to what that does. Um, so I might just move that like way, way over there out of the way. Um, so where? Is this us? Oh, this is us. Okay. So we might have to do, I can't remember how you, how do you select more? I don't know. We're going to start them moving over here. So I don't know if we're going to be able to do anything. Oh, it does say we're on the Thieves. I don't know why we're on the Thieves. Can I... How do you... Scanning area. I need to go... No. It's because I'm not... I'm already being attacked. Nav point locked. Right, it does just put me. No, so I want to. I want to stay in here. So I've got a couple of ships now. Enemy detected. Ready, Commander. No problem. And there is a way of doing like multiple waypoints, isn't there? I have to try and remember. Yeah, we, that that one's a little. Uh, so that's emergency repairs. And you've got the lancers as well, don't you? You might be able to do your lancer. No. Nice. So here, uh. Oh, that's better. Did I purposely swap ships? Does it just change when you. I don't know. I don't want you. Oh, is that one gone? That one's gone. Okay, that's perfect then. Let's move forward. What's your multi strike? We want to be, we want to be above them. I think so. Enemy escort carrier is launching flag cannon turret. Oh, I see. I don't know what to do about that. Front target. Affirmative. Awaiting orders. Enemy targeted. Ready for service. Trying to move him. There we go. I wanted to focus on this one because it's already. Oh my God! What was that? Oh, I think my light just clipped off my monitor and it just freaked me right out. So we've got our lancers back. We might be a little bit... Hello. Look at that. That's cool. 
I'm not paying any attention out there, and I probably should be paying a little bit more attention. That one is so fast. Can we see it? This is below us, so probably not, right? Oh, there we go. Picking right off. That's not a valid target, apparently. What about you? It is so fast. That's the second one, isn't it, I think? I can. Where is this cheeky little one? Good shot. Well, it's almost gone, it's almost gone. So you start going for this guy. Yeah, you go for that. Oh, that's nice, that's nice. That's our friend, isn't it? That's the enemy down there. So the second one's gone. Oh, you are not. You are not. The only thing we didn't do, we didn't really deal with um, targeting certain things on the on the enemy, did we? We just let them go for it. But it's worked out okay. I wanted to see what really happened if we... Or do we just basically collide with our friend then? Yeah, launch your multi-strike. Might do that. Where are we here? Where are we? It's a little hard. There we go. I want you to come up here a little bit. Half point locked. You're both going to have your lances pretty soon. All which I'm looking forward to using, because I think... Should be in range. Nice. Nice. So that's the first time we've had to uh, deal with... Oh, there's another one. Where's that come from? That's the cheeky third one. So this is the one which disappeared. So this one retreated but came back. That's cheeky. I don't fully know... I'm guessing yellow is shield. And then green is... Oh no, is green our hull? Is our hull 67%? I think it is, isn't it? I want to I activate our emergency repairs. Launching emergency repair. Enemy targeted. Your command. And I'm sure they're both targeting it, but... Oh, is that it there? Oh, it's so small. It's so small and cute. It's leveled up, annoyingly. Closing in. Come on now, you're so close to death. Finally, the strike craft is so fast. Oh, there's another one. No, it's the same one. Neither of them get a shot on with their lances at the moment. I wanted to see if we... Oh, he's gone again. Um, yeah, our rear shields are gone. I don't know what we can really... All head full. ...do about that. Yes, blue one, the rear shields are gone. Is there much we can do? Oh, they've lined up perfectly. Look at that. Oh, well, they have, and now we're just continuing to drift. Can you just stay there you are? Um, so, is exit to lobby we want to do? Oh, there we go. I knew there was somewhere where it had the exit command. No contacts. Perfect. Mission complete. Engage warp. Off we go. I do love how this game looks. I think it's absolutely beautiful. And it's always interesting when you have a game set in space how they 
make space not look boring. So obviously, if you're actually in space, I'm pretty sure that Ooh. like 99.999% of the time, all you're going to see is blackness with a few stars. So it's always interesting to see what they do to kind of spice it up a bit. Star Wars Squadrons is particularly good at that as well. Like every level in that, every mission looks amazing. So we've got 12,500 credits, wonderful. Super Cruise found, shield booster available, escort carrier available. Upgrade salvaged, three enemy ships destroyed, total resources 20,000 and two upgrade points. We're going to hit continue. We are not going to retreat. I think we're going to be okay. I am assuming, though, of course, that we do um, do get all our health back. I guess we do. You can see all there. Look. Wonderful. Is there an adjustment bar for this main bit? I can't see one because it's a little close to my desk. It makes me feel a little uncomfortable. Oh, that's one I have selected. I just keep hitting the right same thing. Okay. Yeah, those strike cruisers were interesting. Really interesting how... Oh, that's our hit points. I don't know what supply means then, but the hit points are the shield. New captain skill available. Ooh, uh, we'll go for increased speed then. We'll get a, a little, a wee bit of everything. Assuming he doesn't have anything quite yet, no. So let's hit the next mission. So what do we just do? We just did hired guns, right? Yeah. And we did that, and it's still green. So does that mean we've already done it? So if we try one of these, if we just try armed and dangerous then. Well, that's the easier one, though, isn't it? Hmm. That might not be the worst thing in the world, though. Oh, I don't know. We didn't do too badly with the other one, did we? Should we just have a go? Should we have a go? Science vessel. Destroy the convoy before they escape to the warp points. Give it a go. Let's give it a go. What is the worst that could happen? You can capture ships with the boarding party if the target subsystems are down. That's interesting. So we do need to target, we do need to actually target engines, I think, this time then, don't we? I don't know what that was. I think our ship, our second ship, has been clipped into us, I think. I think that's what I saw before. Uh, we will have the mission briefing, thank you. I am happy to inform you that I was able to arrive at the He definitely looks like someone famous as well. The meeting went well, thanks for asking. I can't think who it is. I can picture him. He's got the same voice as well. I will do what I can. I don't know where they are. Should we just... Yeah, that's fine. Oh, that's interesting. Didn't look... Oh, hello, hello, asteroid. We can't see... Oh, there they are, look. There they are. All head full. So let's... Uh, try to intercept them, shall we? Yeah, this is all interesting. I might have to look at this at some point. Max shield regeneration. So that's the power. What's this? Attack from the left. Oh, I see. I see. Are you, uh, are you moving? We are moving. Okay. Are you moving? And they, although oh, like, we can see them though. They're down there. Okay. It does look like there's an asteroid right in front of us. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. IVNZ proceeding detected. Ready, Commander. Oh, Front our kit. Looks guilty to me. So for blue two, I'm gonna say keep some distance Understood. and then try and target Understood. the back. We're gonna um, we're gonna leave blue two to it a bit. See what happens. Whereas we in blue one. Nice. Enemy is retreating. Yeah, I know. Uh, let's. Lancer, Lancer beam unable to target. Enemy 
Target, target acquired. Front arquette. Target the uh reloading forward batteries. Yeah. It's because I changed your uh, your distance thing, isn't it? I'm going to put that back to I'm going to put it back to 3k then. Because you are just going, you're going miles. Don't go over yes, there. You're going absolutely miles. I am I am on the Thebes, aren't I? Yeah. I don't know why. How is your it's down to 28? Okay, perfect. Are you, uh, are you moving? Understood. Lancer beam is ready. Awaiting directive. Oh, your Lancer beam is ready. Launching Lancer target beam. Lost. Your command. I think I'm going to target this one. And continue targeting its engines. Try and slow them down a bit. Nav point locked. Enemy targeted. Understood. We are targeting from the back, which is kind of nice. Front arcade. Stay close. Awaiting orders. And we've almost got our. Lancer beam is ready. Launch laser beam. Reporting. So we start starting to damage its engines a bit now, because that one's engines are pretty damaged. That's why it's taking so long. I might. Tell them both to target this one now. And target that one's engines. You should have your... Yep, just in time. Your Lancer. Lovely. We could do with targeting this one now. And again, targeting that guy's engines. Do you have your Lancers? No, you're not going to for a little while either. He might escape this dude. That sound is so beefy, that thum 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 thum. I can like feel my headset vibrating, it's crazy. Yeah, they're struggling a little bit to hit that dude. How are we doing? Almost got it, I think that one might be too far away. Oh, no, nope, we're fine. Smack it, lovely. Yeah, so that's engine is now also nearly dead. So now let's both target this one. I'm going to set this one to do a similar thing, say 3k and still aim for the back and we'll just we'll leave them at that. May as well enable the multi-fire for this dude. There it is. Because oh, yeah, he's trying to aim for the back. They're both trying to aim for the back, aren't they? So actually I'm going to change this one to the, to the left. Because if I'm correct, I think the left shield, the, the rear shields are weaker, and I'm assuming the sides are also slightly weaker. Uh, I might send you down there, actually. And I might even consider turning both of their um, fancy options off. Yeah, I might put them both on none, because it's getting a little bit awkward just... When they keep running away like that. All head full. Lancer, Lancer beam unable to target. Switching targets. Lovely. So that one should nearly be dead now, shouldn't it? Was that the retreat? Oh, we need to get that thing like now. Enemy targeted. Understood. I didn't realize that that was the retreat zone. So we need to kill that very, very, very quickly. Mm. Uh, target the primary hull on that one. Because it doesn't have any shield at the back, so we're okay. We don't care about its rate of fire. Mission failed. Oh, damn. The enemy ship has escaped. Whatever they had, it's out of reach now. Damn it. Does it just immediately fail, or do we still get a chance to smack it? No, it's about to jump, isn't it? Lancer yes. Is ready. Right, 
Where's blue one? All the way over there. Yeah, I definitely need to turn off all of that, I think. Maybe if you've got lots and lots of stuff, we would uh, we would concern ourselves with it. So this one, I'm guessing we destroyed it. Yeah, we destroyed its engine completely. That's We should have focused the engines completely on the other ones. I think that's what we should have done. Two ships engage. Oh, both of our ships were engaged, not as in there are two enemies engaged. Yes, yeah, so that's a little bit of a, a learning a learning curve. Lesson learned? Something like that, I don't know. Do you wanna do you wanna come over here? Because right now you are just hidden behind a uh, hidden behind an asteroid of some form. So that's our friendly ship. I don't know where the Understood. Absolutely. Intercept locked. Ready. Lancer beam launched. Lancer oh, there it is. There it is. IVN Thebes moving to intercept. So it doesn't like, it's not like a toggle, it's just like a... I'm trying to see if anything's changing as I'm doing it, but I don't think it is, is it? Because obviously last time we were very much focused on the old... Uh... Oh, I could do with bringing you... A... Oh no, I'm actually quite far from my desk. Yeah, we were doing this, weren't we? I can't remember how we... Oh, that was the, the, that was the, uh, the throttle, wasn't it? Which was great fun. And it was hold it and triggered to fire, I think. But I, I assumed that with that with a couple of ships to worry about, we're probably best off doing it from here. I suppose you could tell one just to target it manually and then then worry about it. Manually. But anyway, we failed the mission, so let's jump out. And I think we've probably got enough time. Oh, I don't know. Maybe not actually. Maybe we are we are sort of getting close to that that magic thirty minute mark. Although I just oh, yeah, I think we're probably. Oh, it is late. I do need to do another video. Oh, oh my! All these conflicting emotions. <laughs> Two. One. If that same mission is there, we'll give it another go. I don't know what happens if you fail a mission. So we earned nothing. We destroyed a ship, but we, uh, we, 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 yeah, we didn't do very well. Um, and we have no supplies remaining. Available. So we are going to have to go back to, to base. Uh, what do we want here? Speed, maybe. I'm gonna go with speed. And you don't have anything, do you know? So let's. Gonna have to jump back to base because we've got no supplies. Warning. Yes, well, we have no supplies, so we're gonna have to withdraw, I'm afraid. Check to see. This should be our flagship. It is our flagship. Don't, I don't feel like I'm on the Leo, though. I don't feel like I'm on the Leo at all. Unless that's blue two and that's blue one, I don't know. I don't know. So we haven't got a, we've got a little bit of money and we have got a few points actually. It is five to unlock that though, so we can't do that. Let's have a little look at what we can do. Let's not worry about the captains. Um, so it's all going to be about the equipment, isn't it? So we could upgrade a few things. Can we replace the lancer beam? No, I don't think so. These are just turrets, aren't they? So you can't can't replace your main unless it's this. Increases all missile. Oh, that's like a that's a passive. Well, that's interesting though. That could be interesting. Increases the max speed for a short period of time. Could also be very interesting. Uh, we have the shield injector. Rapidly recharges all shield arcs and the shield booster, which increases max. Is that like a passive then? That is. Oh, that's actually. Uh, that's interesting. So where does that... So we have a look at our ship. Is that going like one of these slots, would it? Would it go in like this slot here? Yes, it would go there. So you can get either an injector or you can just get a passive. I quite like the idea of the passive, I'll be honest. So I'm going to get that. 
No, I'm not. Why can't I not? Oh, there we go. The buy was greyed out just now. There we go. And can I also then put that in the, um, the, the Thebes? If I've unlocked it, or do I need to lock it for each one? No, I can just put it in the Thebes. Great, let's do that. So they both have got a little bit of a shield boost now. And what can we put in this one, then? Either a Super Cruise. Or we have a Super Cruise. Afterburners increases the max speed for a short period of time. Or Super Cruise. Increases out of combat max speed. Hmm. 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 Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that's uh, particularly worth it. So I think for the Leo, maybe we'll... Oh, the Leo can only have the afterburners. Oh, no, she's got afterburners. Increases max speed. How do I... Oh, no, I haven't got it. It's just unlocked. Okay, let's put the afterburners in that one then. That's huge. Look at that. That's beastie. And then, let's have a look at our equipment. We don't really want to focus on that. So light, light cannon turrets we've got. What's a, what's a flat cannon turret? Uh, increases max shields. What? I don't... I don't understand. It doesn't do any damage, it just increases the shields. Oh no, no. Because that's that. I feel like the flat cannon isn't isn't updating properly. So we have what's the point defense? Can target and destroy incoming missiles used to supply while channeled. Uh, so the light laser turret does twenty times point three sex. I don't understand what that means. Damage per second is 20 times 0.3 seconds. Doesn't make any sense. Uh, the missile turret is 15. And has a, quite a high range. And they are 3 times, so they're 12. So would we be, would we be better off, is what I'm thinking, putting like... Because what's the range on? The range is 6,000 on those. 4,000 on those, 8,000 on the missiles. It has a minimum distance on the missiles, I've just realised, whereas they don't. That's interesting. So if you get too close, so whoever has missiles, really you want to make sure they do have that minimum distance set, because if they are too close, they won't be able to use those. That's interesting. So what I might do... Because the Leo has three light cannons and a laser. I might give it another laser. I mean, it's a shame because I don't want to put one there. I did upgrade those though, didn't I? Because I don't want because because these because this arc is horizontal and this arc is horizontal and these arcs are vertical. But if I upgrade that one, something's over there, it can't hit it. But if I upgrade that one, something over there, it can't. So, if, mm, maybe we do just make both of the front ones lasers. And we have some... F Can you just sell these, I wonder? I don't know. Well, maybe we'll figure that out later on. Right, so let's put, yeah. Let's get two lasers on that one. We'll upgrade both of those. So when it gets a bit closer, 4,000 meters, that's going to start hammering them. And then maybe the other one, the uh, the Thebes, because that's already got a missile launcher on, hasn't it? So maybe we'll give that one two missile launchers. Is that crazy? Is that crazy? I don't know. But it's sort of, sort of going to happen. So we'll give it a missile launcher, and then we shall upgrade... Component upgraded. ...both its missile launchers. Component upgraded. We haven't upgraded the super cruise or the shield booster. I might upgrade the sh oh, no, let's not do it on that one, because that one needs to keep its distance anyway. So maybe on the Leo, we'll upgrade the shield booster. 
just most of our money gone then. That now gives us a 20% bonus to our max shields, which is... That's good. That's good. Now, there's nothing else we're going to be able to afford, but I'm, I'm quite happy with that. So we've got our, our Leo is going to be sort of close range, get in there, smash them with lasers, get rid of their shields. And then the Thebes with the crazy Captain Legs. <laughs> I love his eyes. He, we are going to have to remember to set on him that minimum. It's a shame you can't do it here. You can change their... Um, their options there. But we're going to have to try to remember, and you might have to tell me to remember if we're being honest, to um, to change him so he has a minimum distance of 3,000 meters. Because if he's farther, if he's closer than that, the, the two missile launchers are entirely useless. Cool. So I don't think there's anything we can really get at the moment, is there? Where would this go? We can't afford it, but that could be quite interesting for the Thebes, couldn't it? I don't know where it goes, though. Let's go back. It's not a defensive hardpoint. It's not an engine hardpoint. There is no hardpoint selected. They just both have a lancer beam. Maybe it can't have it. Maybe that's for a different different sort of ship. Um, let's just very quickly take a look. If we look at the ships a little bit... It's a shame it doesn't show you. I'll be quite interested to see. Turret meets. So that has very little in the way of um, things. The Striker Corvette has one turret, one small engine, one medium cannon. Is the medium cannon. What is. What are you? What are you? Are you a striker? No, what, what kind of ship are you? You're, you're the same as this one, aren't you? Oh, so I have two. I can't see where it actually shows you what it is, which is a little unfortunate. But I'm pretty sure they're both the same. Yeah, they are, aren't they? Okay, so they are both assault frigates. So they have two small medium turrets, two small medium cannons. What's the difference between medium turrets and medium cannons? Does that mean that two of their points can use different sized equipment which we don't currently have, perhaps? Um, anyway, Missile Destroyer is two mediums, one engine, one offensive. So that can use the explosive one, actually. So maybe at some point we'll get the Missile Destroyer, load that up with missile launchers, plus the explosive boost, then change this one to be similar with lasers to the, uh, to the Leo. That could be quite cool. Yeah, I could be quite, I'm quite excited about that, actually. Cool. All right, well, we're going to leave that there. Next time we should crack on and try to not um, fail miserably. Um, and, and, yeah, just try to unlock more stuff. I'm just really keen to get as much stuff unlocked as possible. I'm assuming you can unlock more more weapons and stuff. Does it tell you there? See your for your oh, small turret. Small, ah, small cannon turret and small turret. A small laser, small missile turret. So, does that mean some of these don't support? Ah, the two on the side only support cannon turrets, whereas these ones support other types. Ah, okay, all right. I figured that out now. I figured that out. Good to know. Good to know. Cool. Yes, we are going to leave that there. Hope you've enjoyed this latest part for Battle Group VR. If you're enjoying it, hit that like button, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel if you're not already. All those things would be amazing. And of course, don't forget that I stream every Wednesday at 7 p.m. UK time, playing Satisfactory at the moment, which is a wildly different game, but it's just as fun. Trust me. Hopefully, I'll see you there to say hello. Otherwise, I shall see you next time in Battle Group VR. And a massive thank you to Indy for gifting me the game as well. That's much appreciated. And as always, thank you very much for joining me.